We're with District 7 Livingston Parish Councilman Tracy Gerlinghouse tonight who has brought up the proposal of zoning for certain areas of the parish. So Tracy, talk about what uh, brought this up after a long time in which it has not been discussed. Well, I think zoning is uh, one of those things that, that hasn't been addressed in this parish for a long time because the general consensus is that it won't pass. Uh, but I believe that you know, the time has come in order, in order for us to protect the areas that are, over, that are being overdeveloped and not keeping up with the infrastructure needs. Um, the only way we can address certain things being built or not being built is by uh, applying zoning to the situation. All the municipal, well, I'll say Walker, Denham, Livingston, they have zoning regulations and you know it, it actually helps clean up the process in the sense of whether you want whether it makes sense to put a business next to a neighborhood you know i use the the example of let's say an asphalt plant you know right now you can put an asphalt plant next to a neighborhood um, because there's no zoning outside you know those those mentioned before mentioned mentioned municipalities that would really stop it. They meet the requirements of the ordinances laid, by the, laid forth by the parish. And there's really no legal way or no way to stop that from happening. The ordinances, in a sense, make you reactionary, like I'd said earlier. You react to something that you don't like or you think is a bad idea. But that idea still comes through, so you have to make an ordinance to keep that from happening. Well, then something else similar comes along, but it's not completely similar, so the ordinance might not apply to that. So then you have to let that happen and react again. Um, zoning would give the council, that, the, the legislative body, the, the, the parish council, the ability to, to look at a situation, see if it makes sense, and, or if it doesn't, and to some degree it gives you more authority or more latitude to, to make that change or allow something to happen or, or not. Um, I believe that we are way past time in Walker and in Dental Springs, I mean, really in Watson too, for zoning to happen. You know, we have to, I believe that zoning should happen. And I know there are a lot of people out there that don't think that we should, but um, in all honesty, you know, there wasn't a lot of backlash when Walker got when Walker got zoned. A lot of people didn't think they would like it, you know. Um, but it, there's really no downside. There's no downside to zoning. It's only upside if you want to, you know, you're going to grow, and if you want to allow the parish or allow the, the parish or you know any of the areas to grow responsibly, I believe that you have to give the council and the parish the authority to say, you know, this doesn't make sense. This does make sense, um, right? Because right now we we are just having to react. Something happens, we react, and I know a lot of people are frustrated. Think that we should make decisions, you know, what if make decisions that would allow something to not happen? At the same time, if they've met the ordinance requirements, then it's hard to stop them. 